The Farm to Fork strategy is a key component of the European Green Deal that aims to make the EU's food system fair, healthy and environmentally friendly. Although the strategy's aims are clear, the path to achieving them isn't. Current policy narratives put great faith in the idea that innovations will continue to dramatically enhance agricultural practices. But how plausible is this socio-technical imaginary? According to the FAO, global food demand will increase 60% by 2050. What if EU member states are forced to domestically produce the cheap agricultural commodities they currently import? Our analysis showed that very few member states could support such a dramatic internalization. Domestic land and water resources would prove insufficient and the extrapolated fertilizer and pesticide application rates would be ecologically lethal. Environmental problems aside, European agriculture would also struggle with labor requirements. EU farmers receive roughly 40% less income than workers in other sectors. As a result, agricultural labor per hectare of cropland has decreased in the EU by over 30% in just the past two decades. We must recognize that a massive reliance on cheap agricultural imports has enabled a major avoidance of further environmental destruction in the EU. That reliance has also entailed that millions of foreign farmers work to produce what Europe imports and that the ecological issues such as deforestation occur in places like Southeast Asia and South America. Although there's no silver bullet for our problems, one thing is certain for the EU food system to successfully reinvent itself. A more sophisticated assessment of the EU's metabolic profile will be needed.